Hi everyone, and welcome back to the AGF channel. Today we have for you the quickest and easiest home decor DIY, and that is improv coasters. These can be made with scraps from solid fabrics, prints, cotton, flannel, really any leftover fabric pieces you have. So grab your AGF scraps and let's get sewing. Here is what you will need. Various size scraps in different colors and textures. We are using our pure solids in Northern Waters, Sweet Macadamia, Mauvalis, and Dried Roses, in addition to our linen blend in Soft Sand. A piece of batting at least four inches by four inches, a piece of cork that is four inches in diameter, all-purpose adhesive, scissors, and a fabric pen. Start by placing two pieces of fabric right sides together on top of your batting and stitch one quarter inch along one side. Open the two pieces and finger press the seam flat. Choose another piece of fabric and place it along one of the sides of the unit you just sewed. Place it right sides together with the first unit and stitch. Continue attaching scrap pieces to your batting. Since this is an improv project, try not to think too much about placement of the fabrics and just have fun. Sew at different angles, mix larger pieces with smaller pieces, and maybe even add in a rayon or a canvas scrap, or in this case linen, to break up the textures and add a little variety. You can even make small units by sewing two pieces together before stitching it to the batting. Use squares, strips, half circles, even a trapezoid if you're feeling up to it. Don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed making these coasters and subscribe for more great tutorials. Once you have all your scraps attached to your batting, take your cork circle and fabric pen and trace your cork on top of your sewn unit. Next, quilt inside the drawn circle as you see fit for your improv layout. After quilting, stitch 1 8 of an inch inside your drawn line to keep the coaster from fraying after it is completed. Cut on the line you drew. Spread an even layer of your all-purpose adhesive on one side of the cork and firmly press the wrong side of your sewn unit against it to make sure it sticks. And your improv coasters are complete. These are quick to stitch for a last minute gift or easy enough to make sets for every holiday. Happy sewing everyone and I'll see you for the next tutorial.